gotta shut up. And they can't wait for me to come outside. They've come to collect me, the experiment's over, and they've come to pick up their petri dish. And they've sent a machine to do it. Agnes, it's a fucking machine you can see for yourself, okay? They're sending the machines. Okay, listen. If you wanna know what's going on, you're gonna have to listen to me, okay? You have to. Because you don't know the fucking enormity of what we're dealing with here. On May 29, in 1954, a consortium of bankers, industrialists, corporate CEOs and politicians held a series of meetings over three days at the Bilderberg Hotel in Oosterbeck, Holland. And they drew up a plan to maintain the status quo. You know, so the rich could get richer and the poor get poorer. And they devised a plan that would manipulate technology, the media, population control, world religion to keep things the way they are. And they have continued to meet every year, once a year, since the original meeting. You can look it up, okay? And under their orders, the CIA had smuggled Nazi scientists into the States to work with the American military at Caspan, developing an inter-epidermal tracking microchip. It's a surveillance tool, a computer chip that's been implanted in the skin of every human being born on this planet since 1982. And the test group for the prototype? That was the People's Temple. And when the Reverend Jim Jones threatened to expose them, he and every member of his church were assassinated. But it's not enough just to track people as spying them. What they want is control. So they create the intelligence manned interface by a chip. A subcutaneous transponder that's imprinted with living brain cells. They needed lab rats to test this, yeah? So they found us. Me in the Gulf and another soldier who was working at Caspin at the time, Tim McVeigh. And they turned us into fucking zombies. Remote controlled assassins. And they found him. They, they picked him up. They threw him into a prison factory. But I found my chip and I cut it out. So they sent me back to the lab for further testing in a new experiment. They want me to be John Doe number two. But that is the problem with the IMI biochip. They just can't get to everybody. You know, people, they, they, they can slip through the cracks. They could just find the chip. They, they just cut it out like me and like Ted Kaczynski. What they need is a chip that will self-perpetuate, that will spread like a virus, that the people can pass on to each other, to everyone, and now they have it. The living, breathing organism, the ultimate parasite, and implanted by a queen bug, the super mother who mates with the drone, lays egg sacs in the body of the host, and governs a growing army of rapidly multiplying brainwashing bugs.